Hello again. A cracker of a day for most of us today. It's easy to see the clear skies over the country from our satellite loop. Much of the Tasman Sea also remains cloud free, although well to the north of New Zealand, the tropics has had a lot of cloud. A broad cloud band extends from Tasmania southeastwards. Much of this cloud is associated with a strong upper atmosphere northwest jet stream, but also embedded in the cloud is a front. This front moves steadily towards the far southwest of New Zealand tonight, reaches Dunedin around midday tomorrow before weakening as it heads northeast. Ahead of the front is a weak trough which marks a prefrontal southwest change up the east coast and the front stalls about the far southwest coast of the South Island tomorrow and becomes stationary over Fiordland. Otherwise we see the high pressure over the North Island begin to slowly retreat northeast. So sunny skies from Nelson to Canterbury but low cloud moving north along the Canterbury coast in the morning reaching the Kaikoura coast in the evening. Cloudy for Southland and Otago with occasional rain developing. Cloudy also for Buller and Westland, with drizzle turning to rain in the afternoon. Fiordland sees rain setting in the morning with heavy falls possible in the north and northwest winds changing southwest in behind the front. But another day of sunshine for the north and it's going to be very hot in the east. Areas of cloud in the west from Northland to Taranaki burning off and giving way to sunny skies in the morning. A cloudy start from Taranaki to the Kapiti coast with patchy drizzle about the Tararuas. Westerly winds in the north, nor'westerlies elsewhere and those will be strong and gusty south of about Hastings in the morning. Cloud increasing with rain developing after midday as the gusty nor'westerly turns southerly and the cargo gets rain from morning as the strong west turns southwest. Heavy morning rain for Milford Sound as gusty nor'westerlies turn southeast. Drizzle turning to rain after lunch for the rest of the west. Nelson, the place to be with sunshine and a very nice 25 degrees. Burnham turning up the heat tomorrow. Sunny and a 30 degree high. Fine and warm for the rest too. But Timidu will get cloudy periods and drizzle from afternoon as gusty nor'westerlies turn southerly. Keep a cool drink handy and it's time to break out the shorts. If you're out and about the east of the North Island, Hastings aiming for a high of 30 degrees. Napier and Gisborne hot on your heels with a top of 29. Cooler over here with fresh northerlies about the Kapiti coast. Cloudy at times but you will get some sunny spells too. Palmerston North you get a top of 20. And a sunny day for the centre north with westerly winds. Tokoroa will get some morning cloud but that burns off leaving you with a nice afternoon. And 23. And another golden day for the north with light winds or westerly breezes. Fitianga and Paihia aiming for 24. Fine at first in Eden, but cloud increasing in the morning with rain developing early afternoon. Strong nor'westerlies changing southerly in the morning, then dying out at night. Top of 20 for you. Christchurch is sunny and hot at first, but cloud from afternoon. Gusty nor'west winds changing southerly, dying out at night. A warm 27 degrees. The capital is cloudy morning and night, otherwise sunny spells, strong northerlies easing in the evening and 19. Cloud top and tails your day Hamilton with lots of sunshine in between, westerly breezes and 22 and a sunny day for Tauranga with westerly winds, 24 is your high. Areas of morning cloud otherwise sunny for Auckland, southwest breezes and a top of 20. So to our Aussie neighbours, the odd shower in Sydney, Melbourne, Hobart and Darwin, where they also may get some thunderstorms. Rain for Canberra, fine for the remaining cities. And out east, New Caledonia continues to get showers while it's fine in Vanuatu, as well as Tonga, Fiji and the Southern Cooks. Showers also in Samoa, while rain and thunderstorms affect Niue. On Thursday, a ridge of high pressure over northern New Zealand begins to weaken and a front lies slow moving over the far south while a trough approaches the country from the Tasman Sea and the trough moves east over New Zealand on Friday followed by a strong disturbed westerly flow. So a period of rain spreading in from the west, you can see it there. By Saturday, there will be fine breaks in the north, also about the east coast. Heavy thundery falls continue about the west of the South Island. So we move from sun hats to wet weather gear over the next few days. That is your weather.